Guys, Nick here from Jones Fitness. We're back with Wednesday's wad. So today we're gonna to work in a slightly more strength-based wad. We've got three main exercises. You're gonna complete as many reps with good form as you can or max effort. So the plank, the third one, you're gonna go for as long as you can. Basically, you're gonna set the time for 20 minutes and you're just gonna complete as many rounds, as many reps as you can in that time frame. okay? So everyone's gonna to work to a slightly different beat, if you will. So, exercise number one, we're gonna start with a push-up drop set. Now, sounds super complicated, do not worry. Basically, what happens is, we are gonna start by doing as many close grip press-ups as you can. When you can do no more, you're then gonna to go to a medium grip, so your hands a little bit wider, do as many as you can. Then we're gonna finish with wide grip press ups, doing as many as you can. So theoretically, that movement gets easier the wider our hands go. However, you're gonna be a little bit more tired, so it's gonna make it a little bit more challenging. It doesn't matter how many you do, I just want you to go to max effort, so with good form, okay? So you might end up doing seven reps, three reps, one rep, you might end up doing six reps, two reps, one rep, does not matter, just go, okay? After that, we're gonna do elevated squats, which I will demo in a second, and then we're gonna finish off with planks. So. For a practical example, so you can kind of see what the press-ups look like, if I do them front-facing, so you can see kind of where my hands are. So we're gonna start off close grip. So hands underneath my shoulders, and again from there, we come down, elbows brush past my side, and up. So controlled on the way down, and up. Get into good tempo. When you can do no more, you're then gonna take your hands like one and a hand, ha hand widths wider, basically. So then we come down from there. Still trying to get chest in between our hands. Come down to there and up, complete as many as you can. When you can do no more there, again, another hand spacing wider. So you can see on this white line that I'm kind of like underneath here, we get, that's how wide we are now. So still trying to get chest down in between my hands. And again, working through from there. Again, really, really effective way to tax your chest, shoulders and triceps. So that's number one. Have a little breather, have some water, then we're gonna move on to elevated squats. An elevated squat is basically just a way where we do a third of a squat, two thirds of a squat, then a full squat as one rep. So nice controlled, what we're gonna do, we're gonna squat down to the bottom, we're gonna come a third of the way up, back down to the bottom, little pause, two thirds of the way up, back down to the bottom, little pause, and then all the way up, that counts as one. So. Pause at the bottom, one third, back down. Two thirds, back down, all the way to the top. You're gonna to go until you feel like you can't do any more because your legs are like jelly and shaking. After that, have a little sip of water, get a breather, then you're gonna see how long you can hold a plank for. So, normal setup, and again, just hold, just hold until you something gives out. Again, just nice and strong, nice deep breath, don't hold your breath, and then down and done. Guys, that's it. Enjoy today's strength quad and we'll see you tomorrow.